Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to make these mini 3D style cookies. Perfect for the Super Bowl. Stay tuned and I will show you how. The things that I used, a 2 inch round cookie cutter and a 2 inch oval cookie cutter. I used brown and leaf green food coloring and white roll icing. Alright guys, let's get started. So this is the first thing that I'm going to be doing with the cookie. I'm going to be filling it out. As you see there, they're not completely round. They don't have to be neat because this is going to be at the base of the uh, the spiky um, grass. I'm going to be putting the ball here in the center and then I'm going to pipe the grass around it. So it doesn't have to be neat. It doesn't have to be perfectly smooth. Just as long as there is um, icing as close to the edge as possible. All right, so I'm gonna give this about an hour, 45 minutes to an hour, just so it could crust a little bit. Right here is I cut down the bottom part. I just used the, a knife and then just trimmed out the bottom part because I need this to stand on top of my cookie like this. And so if I have it rounded like this, it'll have a harder time to stick. So flat will be ideal for this, like this. So what I'm gonna do here, I have here number two in a brown, and I'm just going to kind of eyeball it. You can use a edible marker to give you some guidelines. Uh, if you wish, that'll help a lot too. But I'm just going to eyeball it and then just make a, a football shape and then I'm just going to fill it in all right now you don't have to be perfect here at the bottom because this is going to be hidden by the grass so this will be good enough now here I have this one that has been drying I would recommend giving it a good hour to dry even though it's a small area but I do highly suggest it because you're going to be uh, piping some white over it and you don't want that um, icing that brown icing to get absorbed in your white. It has the little um, stitching on the top, so I'm gonna do that. And I am using a tip zero and a pretty thick white consistency, or white white uh, icing and a thick consistency. And so using the same icing, I just switched the tip to a Wilton tip 44 and I'm going to do the two white lines that are curved and I'm just going to bring it from one end to the other. You can do these white lines first if you wish and then do the, the um, stitching, whichever you prefer. And then make sure that this white isn't touching your cookie that is just touching the ball all right so I'm gonna set this aside to dry all right guys so your football has to be nice and dry and what you're gonna do is take your round green cookie and with some thick consistency this is um, a Wilton 233 it's a grass tip and then just pipe all around. I like to go around the borders first Oops. and then go inside. Now if your icing is thick enough your cookie should stand pretty much on its own when you first put it on there. This is why I said to cut the bottom part and not leave it like roundish. It has to have this flat part at the bottom so it could lay flat like that. So it should stand like that. And on the back, just pipe some icing and then just kind of bring it up high like this so it'll dry and stick to that back cookie and help support it when it dries. And do the same thing at the bottom, just don't lift it up too high. And that's it. And that's what that's gonna look like. All right guys, really quickly, I'm gonna do a two for one on this video. I'm gonna show you a different way to make these if you do not wanna take a step to do um, a separate cookie. You can also get these uh, football cupcake toppers. You can get these from eBay. And 
they will look like this with the uh, stick that goes into your cupcake. But just cut that off and just make sure that when you serve these, you let, uh, especially the children, because um, they might not know as much as like an adult would, that these are not edible, that they are plastic, so you know you don't want them sticking them in their mouths and choking on it. So just be very careful with that. So I'm gonna do the same exact thing that I did for the prior cookie and this ice, the surrounding of the round cookie with the same tip, same thick icing, same method, and then just set your little football in the center like this, and then just pipe some grass around it. You can tip your cookie like you see that I'm doing here, that way you can go to towards the bottom of it, and you'll leave it like that. So that's what it's going to look like. Okay, so this is how they should look once they're done. So I hope you like these cookies and that you find them pretty easy to make. They would be perfect for a football themed birthday party or for Father's Day or for your Super Bowl party if you want to make some little snacks. These would be great for that. Pretty interesting. And don't forget to check out my uh, football uh, field cookie that I have already uploaded. Pretty easy cookie to make as well. Alright guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Thumbs it up if you did. Subscribe if you haven't done so. And stay tuned for more. Thank you so much for watching. And I will talk to you soon. Have a good one guys.